I'm Stephanie Savage in Echo Park, where video from this surveillance camera could help put a violent criminal behind bars. Jay, the Denny's behind me is back open tonight, but it was closed for hours after more than a dozen people were treated for food poisoning. I'm Stephanie Savage with Claudia Lee. We're here in Hollywood where kids are getting the party of their life. Reporter Stephanie Savage joins us now with the story. Stephanie. Jay, we're at police headquarters where detectives are investigating a double stabbing, which could be a hate crime. Take a good look at the man in this surveillance video. Police say he stabbed two men after a street fight in Echo Park. It is pretty sad. I showed a photo to Sophia Siegel, who says she was surprised when she heard about the attack. I think it's pretty scary. I think it's pretty sad for local community because it seems like it's a really family oriented community, people looking out for one another. So it's just, it's just not good. The attack happened near Echo Park and Scott Avenue just after midnight. You can see in the video the suspect runs and stabs a man, then stabs a second man who chased him down. We're hopeful that people will come forward. Police spokesperson Wendy Reyes says the motive for the crime may be hate. And the crime is being investigated as a hate crime. The suspects had made uh, derogatory comments uh, in regards to the perceived uh, sexual orientation of the victims. I think we need more cops out here, I guess at night. The victims were taken to a local hospital where they're listed in stable condition. If you can help, call 1-877-LAPD 24-7. For CNN I Report, I'm Stephanie Savage. Jay, back to you. Okay, Stephanie, thanks for that report. Hey, LA, welcome to the Weekend Wrap. I'm Stephanie Savage. We're here in Hollywood where the stars are coming out for the kids. From Rachel A. Cook to Claudia Lee, the stars hit the true Hollywood nightclub for a good cause. They're out for the Wonderland party to benefit Children's Hospital Los Angeles. I talked to Cook about the event. This is a time when the community can come together and say, hey, let's all lend our support and show love. Um, it's going to be bonding. I wanted to be here to support all the children. I think it's such a great cause that the Children's Hospital is having this awesome event. Held in Hollywood, kids were treated to an Alice in Wonderland-like setting. Celebrities mingled with the children throughout the display, all to make them smile. Are you excited for today? Yeah. What are you looking forward to doing? To meeting celebrities. I came out because first of all, I love Wonderland, and second of all, this is such a great cause to support the Children's Hospital. Children's Hospital spokesperson Lindsay Hutchinson says the event will have a long-lasting impact on the kids. Anytime you can take them out and distract them from the, you know, the, the hard things that they're dealing with, with fun and celebrities and free goodies, you know, that's just a, it's a wonderful way to heal them emotionally. Now this is the first year of the event and organizers have already started planning next year's party. For the Weekend Wrap, I'm Stephanie Savage. I'll see you next week.